a massive winter storm is about to hit, threatening much of Europe, Russia, and the Caucasus. This isn't your average cold snap. Three major atmospheric forces are colliding to create a rare and dangerous event. Scientists call it a triple threat, extreme cold, intense moisture, and powerful storms all at once. The result? Heavy snow, dangerous ice, and severe weather for millions. What's happening in the Pacific Ocean and high in the stratosphere is directly impacting Europe's weather. The main story frigid Arctic air is set to clash with warm wet air from the south, generating explosive energy. This collision will fuel blizzards, ice storms, and hazardous conditions across the continent. Unlike a typical cold spell or a wet winter storm, this event combines both, making it especially dangerous. The mix of extreme cold and high moisture is what sets this storm apart. People need to take this seriously and prepare for more than just a few chilly days. Weather experts are urging everyone to pay close attention to warnings. This is a high-impact event, not just a routine winter storm. Understanding how these global systems connect helps explain why the forecast is so severe. Preparation now is crucial for safety in the days ahead. The storm's main impact will hit between November 28th and December 7th, with the worst weather likely from November 29th to December 3rd. Expect major disruptions to travel, power, and daily life during this peak. Western and Central Europe, Germany, France, Poland, and neighbors will be hit first by the cold surge. Western and Central Russia will see the heaviest, most persistent snowfall. The Caucasus region faces multiple hazards at once, from snow to flooding. This isn't a single storm moving across the map. It's a collision zone where Arctic air, a wavy jet stream and southern moisture all meet. The danger zone will shift across the continent over 10 days, so timing will vary by location. Local weather updates are essential to know when your area is at highest risk. Earlier forecasts predicted a mild winter, but the sudden triple threat changed everything. The atmosphere can shift quickly, creating new dangers with little warning. This is now expected to be an unusually destructive early winter event. Calm weather now doesn't mean you're safe. Conditions are primed for a rapid, severe storm. Take warnings seriously and prepare for major impacts. The setup is perfect for a fast-developing high-impact storm. Stay alert and ready as the situation evolves. One key driver of this storm is a weak but persistent La Nina in the Pacific Ocean. La Nina means cooler than normal Pacific waters, which subtly shift global weather patterns. This year's La Nina has set the stage for a colder European winter by making the jet stream wavier. That waviness lets Arctic air plunge much farther south than usual. The effect has been building for months, creating a reservoir of cold air over the poles. Think of it as filling a bathtub with cold water, ready to spill south when triggered. La Nina doesn't directly cause storms in Europe, but it primes the atmosphere for severe cold outbreaks. Without it, Europe might have seen a milder winter. It's the first link in the chain leading to this extreme event. The global climate system is deeply interconnected. What happens in the Pacific can impact millions in Europe. This background cold is now being unleashed by other atmospheric events. La Nina's subtle influence is a crucial part of the triple threat. It's a reminder of how small changes far away can have huge consequences at home. The second major factor is sudden stratospheric warming, or SSW, high above the Arctic. Normally the polar vortex keeps frigid air locked over the pole, but an SSW rapidly heats the stratosphere, weakening or even breaking the polar vortex. This opens the freezer, letting Arctic air spill south into Europe and Russia. This year's SSW is happening unusually early, releasing cold air while southern regions are still warm and moist. The result? A huge temperature contrast, fueling powerful storms. SSW is the trigger that unleashes the cold air La Nina has been storing. The effects take a week or two to reach the surface, lining up perfectly with the storm's forecast. The early timing means more energy and moisture are available for severe weather. It's like opening a freezer in a steamy kitchen. Expect a blast of cold and a lot of frost. SSW events are rare and dramatic, and this one is perfectly timed for maximum impact. The combination of SSW and La Nina is what makes this storm so severe. The stage is set for a major winter outbreak. The third piece is the deep negative phase of the Arctic Oscillation, AO, and North Atlantic Oscillation, NAO. 
In a negative phase, high pressure over the Arctic and low pressure over Europe disrupt the usual jet stream. The jet stream becomes wavy, dragging Arctic air south and pulling warm, wet air north from the Atlantic. This creates a collision zone where cold and moisture meet right over Europe and Russia. The wavy jet stream acts like a slide for cold air and a conveyor belt for storms. The negative AO jot NAO is the steering wheel for this entire event. It's responsible for directing both the cold and the moisture into the same region. This setup is classic for severe winter outbreaks in Europe. The result, heavy snow, freezing rain, and blizzards across a huge area. The negative phase amplifies the impact of La Nina and SSW. All signs point to a strong negative AO NAO during the forecast period. This is the final ingredient making this storm so dangerous. The jet stream's wild swings are the delivery system for the coming chaos. This storm is happening on a planet that's warming fast, especially in Europe. Warmer oceans, like the North Atlantic and Mediterranean, now hold much more moisture. That extra moisture is fuel for storms, making them stronger and wetter. When the loopy jet stream pulls this moisture north, storms become supercharged. The result? Heavier snow, more intense rain, and greater risk of flooding and power outages. Climate change also means the snow is denser and heavier, increasing the risk of roof collapses and downed power lines. This isn't the light, fluffy snow of the past, it's wet, heavy, and destructive. The triple threat sets up the storm, but climate change loads it with extra energy. Impacts are now far worse than they would have been decades ago. The combination of natural and human-driven factors is creating a high-impact event. Climate change is the intensifier, turning a dangerous storm into a potential disaster. The severity of this event is a direct result of our changing climate. The message natural patterns create the risk, but climate change amplifies the danger. In Western and Central Europe, the biggest threat isn't just snow, it's ice. Arctic air will sweep in fast over wet ground, causing a dangerous flash freeze. Roads and sidewalks will turn to ice almost instantly, creating widespread black ice. Black ice is nearly invisible and extremely hazardous for drivers and pedestrians. The risk of accidents will skyrocket as surfaces freeze without warning. Freezing rain is another major danger. Rain falls, then freezes on contact, coating everything in solid ice. The weight of this ice can snap tree branches and bring down power lines, causing outages. This isn't about huge snow totals, it's about sudden, severe icing. Travel will be treacherous, and power loss is likely. People should avoid travel during the peak and prepare for possible extended outages. The combination of flash freezing, black ice, and freezing rain is a multi-layered threat. Preparation and caution are essential to stay safe. This region faces a unique and dangerous winter challenge. In western and central Russia the main threat is relentless blizzards and massive snowfalls. The jet stream will funnel moisture from the Black Sea, dumping huge amounts of snow, travel will become impossible and some communities may be cut off. Strong winds will create deep drifts and whiteout conditions. Rain on snow events are a special danger. Rain falls on existing snow, then freezes, creating dense heavy layers. This can lead to roof collapses and major infrastructure stress. The Caucasus faces the highest risk. Mountains force moist air upward, causing extreme precipitation. Expect avalanches at high elevations and landslides or flash floods lower down. Multiple hazards, snow, avalanches, floods, could strike at once, overwhelming emergency services. The region's complex terrain makes the situation even more dangerous. The storm's impact here is about volume and variety of threats. Preparation is critical for both residents and authorities. The coming days will test the resilience of these regions. This isn't just another winter storm, it's a rare convergence of powerful forces. The triple threat of La Nina, SSW, and a negative AO NAO is creating a uniquely dangerous event. Most cold outbreaks in Europe are dry, this one is loaded with moisture, thanks to warm seas. The result record-breaking snow, ice and a wide range of hazards. It's not just one region or one type of danger. This storm brings blizzards, ice storms, floods, and avalanches across an entire continent. Each area faces its own unique risks, requiring different preparations. The scale and variety of threats make this event especially hard to manage. 
The synchronized alignment of global weather patterns is amplifying the impact. Climate change is making everything worse by adding extra fuel. This is not business as usual. Europe must be ready for a high-impact event. Understanding the triple threat and the role of moisture is key to preparation. Heed expert warnings and prepare for the specific dangers in your region. Staying informed and ready is the best way to stay safe in the days ahead.